two, one, go. Hi, so just a quick video to introduce to you uh, Baumer's inclination sensor here. So this is the small body GIM140R. Uh, this can do one dimensional or two dimensional uh, inclination sensing. Uh, this version here that I have is a two dimensional version and it can do inclination in the X axis like so and also in the Y axis like so. So X axis and Y axis. So you've got options to do plus or minus uh, 60 degrees. Um, the version here that I have is an analog output version, zero to 10 volts, and it does a inclination of plus or minus 45 degrees and plus or minus 45 degrees in this manner. So now onto a bit of a practical demo. You can see I've got the sensor uh, wired up to a analog output display. This version here is zero to 10 volts and uh, also plus or minus 45 degrees. And the resolution is 0 0.05 degrees and the accuracy at 25 degrees Celsius is plus or minus 0.4 degrees. So, as you can see, uh, while the sensor is sitting flat on its, uh, on its back there, it's giving us five volts output. If I now tilt slowly, <clears throat> you can see the analog output is changing. Till I reach that 45 degrees, and now it's zero. If I now tilt, the other direction back to flat you see we are at five volts if i now tilt 45 degrees in the other direction you can see i get to my 10 volts and that is your zero to 10 volt range on this sensor So as mentioned, this sensor can um, read inclination in two planes, so in the X and Y direction here. So now I've changed the display to uh, measure the inclination in the Y direction. So again, it's plus or minus uh, 45 degrees. If I now start to raise the front end here, you can see it goes down and down and down till I hit that 45 degrees point, and now at zero volts, I tilt down again to the almost flat table, giving us our five volts. If I lift the back end of the sensor slowly to 45 degrees, there's our 10 volts. So now we're looking at 10 volts to the mid flat point, Five volts, then lift the front end to our zero volts. So like I said, this version here can do two uh, planes simultaneously. So two separate outputs of analog. Uh, this version here is zero to 10 volts. On both outputs, you can get four to 20 milliamp. Also, the resolution in both directions is 0 0.05 degrees and the accuracy at 25 degrees Celsius is plus or minus 0.4 degrees in both ranges. So yeah, small compact inclination, uh, high accuracy sensor with two outputs. There is also one dimensional outputs uh, available also, perfect for tricky applications in a nice convenient size. So just to summarize, here we have the small GIM140R inclination sensor. And this is available in one dimension or two dimensions. One dimension, zero to 360 degrees, or two dimensions, plus or minus uh, 60 degrees. It works on MEMS capacitive measuring principle. 
It's an aluminium housing and uh, IP67 69K protection on that. Uh, also available uh, in CAD open um, interface. So I demonstrated the analog output uh, over two wires on the two dimensional version. And also to make you aware that we have the larger size Jim one, uh, sorry, Jim 500R, which is also available in two dimensions or one dimensional uh, measurement. Same MEMS capacitive measuring principle. This is a 52 mil uh, body size. This one here, the Jim 140 is 48 mil body size, so slightly smaller. And also to make you aware, of course, that this is available in analog and can open interface also.